Hi guys, it's Matthew here and welcome back to another YouTube video. So today guys, we're going to be opening a full booster box of Fusion Strike uh, from Sword and Shield. We are after this really lovely alternate art, um, I believe it's Gengar VMAX. So we're going to dive right in. I don't want this video to take all day. So we're going to be fairly tearing through the booster packs pretty quick. Uh, I'm not going to lie. Um, yeah, guys, so let's dig in. Super excited. This is the channel's first full Pokemon booster box opening. Um, yeah, I'm very excited to, to look at this set. I haven't opened anything from it yet. Um, I'm shaking the camera, which is how excited I am. So cool, guys. Let's start opening packs and uh, see where we can go. So yeah guys, this set has some very, very pretty cards in it. Um, obviously, the Gengar VMAX Secret I think is the most expensive card in the set. So yeah, let's just dive in and uh, start seeing what we can get. So we've got a lovely Togeta Maru and we have a Holo Obstagoon. Just gonna check back here real quick. We have a beautiful Ninetales. The art on that Ninetales is stunning. Um, yeah, and on to pack number two. So yeah, guys, let's see how many awesome, cool cards we can get out of here. Um, it would be nice to, yeah, get some secrets, some rainbow rares, anything like that. We've got a Zorora there. Um, yeah, it would be pretty sweet just to see what we can get. Uh, as I said, this is the channel's first full booster box for Pokemon. So if you guys enjoy this video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, leave a comment. Um, it's all a big help and it, uh, yeah, it really helps with these boxes. Um, yeah, that's about it really. So let's keep going. We've got a little Slezipede, we have a Makuhita, we have a Yvettel just chilling there on the rare slot and some uncommons at the back. Um, I didn't even know that they were in this set, so that's pretty awesome. Um, yeah, guys, have you guys ever gotten any crazy, insane, um, box openings, I guess, from this set? Have you guys opened anything niche, anything cool in the last few days? Let me know in the comments below. That would be, uh, that'd be pretty awesome, you know? And guys, again, in the near future, I will be doing another Pokemon giveaway for, uh, some Pokemon codes for the TCG game. So make sure you guys tune in for that, um... You don't want to miss it. There will be a lot of codes to give away. And yeah, I'm excited for it. I'm excited to be opening packs here. Um, hopefully I don't have to split this video in two. We'll see how the timer goes. But uh, yeah, I may have to split this video into two parts. But uh, yeah, we'll find out as we go. Um, so we're going through Mankey, Krogunk, a beautiful Smurgle. We have a uh, Hollow Landorus, which is pretty nice. But no full arts as of yet, but we're only a few packs in, so let's see. Let's see, can we find a few few special pretty ones in here somewhere? Um, Phantop, Snorlax, Snom, Aracuda. Uh, that Cursula is pretty, pretty neat looking. But yeah, guys, um, honestly, yeah, Pokemon this opening these packs has been a uh, has been a pretty pretty awesome experience so far um really enjoyed just yeah just being able to like go back to my to my childhood really and enjoy these so our first um i guess full art is Inteleon v which is pretty awesome pretty sweet um and yeah guys look at that it's, uh, it's a very pretty pretty pokemon card i'm not gonna lie um Let's see, can we get some more though? We really, really would like that Gengar. That Gengar would be amazing. Uh, it would be phenomenal. Uh, I think it's the rarest card in the packs. Uh, unless there's one rarer than it. I'm not actually sure how the rarities work in Pokemon. Like, obviously, I know there are gold, there are secrets, there are rainbow rares too and stuff like that. So, yeah, I guess, uh, I guess we'll find out soon enough. Uh, hopefully if we pull any of them. Uh, gonna put this code over here and carry on. We have a Meowth, an Onyx, a Hippotle. Ooh, a nice Huntail there. Um, and some Uncommons. Beautiful Lapras at the back there. And yeah, guys. Uh, this is, uh, 
yeah, it's been a fun, it's been a fun, it's been about, I guess, half a year now that I've been opening stuff on YouTube. And uh, guys, yeah, I would really recommend it. It's just a nice way, it's a nice hobby. Um, it's been definitely a bit of a learning curve, but uh, I have really enjoyed it. And it's nice to just like sit back and relax in the evenings and just kind of like, you know, just like open packs of cards and just like, you know, enjoy the art, enjoy the, the thrill of the hunt. Speaking of hunt, we have another hunt tail, a uh, beautiful sharpedo there. And yeah, guys, it's really just nice to just like sit back and just like be like, oh, wow, like this set is pretty or these cards are cool or especially when you open something that's like really expensive, right? You kind of want to, you want to cherish those moments, you know, because it's like a nice, it's like nice to open things like secrets and full arts but it's it's especially nice if it's i don't know if it's your favorite pokemon i guess is always a nice one um like here we go we have a hollow steelix i have a big soft spot for steelix and he is yeah look at him he's beautiful he's stunning so so far only one v card so far but hopefully maybe that's a sign that something good is in our future we'll just have to wait and see um i'm not sure if oh there goes the code uh we have a phalanx corviknight and a, again this nine tails art stunning absolutely stunning okay guys i think we're about halfway through the box now and so far just one v card so i don't know is that the average for these packs uh i'm not really sure i guess uh should i be expecting like a decent amount from it we have a bug catcher we have a luxray as the rare in that one um, yeah, I guess, does anybody know? Like, can it be one to two? Can it be five, six, seven? Like, does it really depend on the box? Or are there no, like, proper, I guess, ratios for these? Uh, we have a beautiful Toxel. Ooh, guys, we have a stunning Bolt Hunt VMAX. That is a beautiful card. Oh, wow. He is, he's very, very pretty. Okay, well, he's gonna hop down here um that is a really really nice card wow okay nice guys well we're two we've got two um the first part of, yeah this video is definitely gonna have to be two parts so i'm gonna link the second part down below and make sure that you guys click on that uh we're just opening piles of cool stuff now we've got a mu v there which is very very pretty very beautiful um not sad about that at all and yeah, guys, make sure you check out the second part. Um, you don't want to miss any more awesome, cool pulls from this box. Um, I'm absolutely destroying this booster now, which is super sad. Uh, come on, we're getting there. We got there in the end. Oh my god, there's just a pile of booster packs over here in the corner, but that's okay. We're not sad about it. Um, cool, so we have a Quillfish, Ben Nelby, ooh, a nice Meloetta. And some frost moths. Okay, let's see. What else can we get in here? Hopefully there's a few more awesome things in here. There we go. Get that out. Get the code. Right, we have a lovely shelter, a Voltorb, a Pansage, a Marsh Stomp, another Corviknight. Do you guys notice, are the rares very repetitive in Pokemon booster boxes? Um, you know, like, do you, do you get, like multiples i think i've had two huntails now and two corviknights and like i guess for 36 like the sets are are decent sized right so like it's not like i should be getting you know like a lot of um duplicates right but i don't know but there we go i got another duplicate there which is a vettel um okay guys i'm gonna end part one here please make sure that you go and check out part two and uh yeah i'll see you over there in part two of our fusion strike booster box opening